know. It's drawing closer to the end of summer. I've been shuffling through my Pinterest board and going through all of my dresser drawers and my closet to find things that I'm excited to wear. I found quite a few outfits that I'm going to share with you today. So I have this really beautiful, almost olive toned green crop top. It's definitely a ribbed fabric. I thought it would look really good with this really pretty floral skirt. The skirt has some slits on the side and it's almost a little hidden until you make a little peeky poo with the thigh and calf. I also paired my Doc Martin slides with this. It's one of those tops that are just barely cropped enough. I could just scroll the shirt on down a little bit, hike up my skirt a bit, and then pair it with a really cute gold belt. Also wearing this with a nice cool pair of mushroom top slides works just as good for a potentially rainy or particularly windy day. My next outfit is sincerely paying homage to summer. I'm juicing up the season and I have these baggy denim shorts that are quite high-waisted. They're kind of almost like boyfriend shorts in a way because they're super baggy. I thought it would be really cool paired with this dark green bandeau top and then I have this really cool button-up top that's airy and flowy and it has these beautiful deep green blue and brown colors in it. With the brown I thought I would pair it with my brown mushroom top slides to really pull out that dark deep color because of course in the fall it is notorious for having the most extravagant colors that the earth can see during that time, right? I'm not letting go of the cooler tones yet but don't, don't you worry, the darker colors are coming in. They really are. Mm. I'm sipping on some sage tea at the moment. I also put a different tea bag of black tea in it to kind of richen and liven up the flavor. Then I put a stick of cinnamon in there to add a little bit more spice. This pair of shorts I can wear a couple of different ways. This next button up top is more of an earthy color, a little bit more neutral to actually really play into the upcoming season. I really love the botanical plants all over it and this time I just buttoned it up and tucked it into my shorts a little bit to give that summer slouch that we all love oh so much. <laughs> One of my very favorite basics to keep in the wardrobe, especially during the summer, is a black braided belt, okay? The black braided belt, that is a staple. And with this baggy pair of shorts, it just really finalizes, adds a little bit of something to the outfit. We're still keeping it strong with the short shorts and skirts. I'm starting to bring in more of the autumn colors with this outfit. I decided to put together this bright red skirt with the white daisies on it with this off-white tank top and it's lined around the chest with this color block of red that pairs with the mini skirt perfectly. Red is one of the very first colors that we get to see during the autumn. That's kind of why I thought, you know what, it's still hot outside but let's bring in the red. If it was a particularly chilly day, I would throw on this black cardigan sweater over top of it. To kind of give a little bit of separation between the tank top and the mini skirt, I have my black braided belt. With this outfit, I'm pairing it with my good old faithful moccasins. I think we all have a basic pair of shoes that we run to. These are my go-to. For those that feel a little bit turned off to blending browns and blacks together, I could totally wear my black Doc Martens. If it's gonna be chilly, you know, autumn time is coming through. I, I'm gonna have to start parting ways with my sandals. This next outfit is very simple and sweet. Some days I wake up in the morning and I do not feel like accessorizing. This outfit speaks to me. Why not walk around looking like a little doily? You know, I like macrame. There's this high-waisted capri that I paired with my crochet button-up top. It's kind of see-through because it is a doily with a lace mauve toned bralette. If the sun is hitting me just right, you're gonna get a little cheeky peek. The capri pays perfect homage to summer. There's a zipper in the front of these capris and I really like them. They are extremely breathable. It's just enough fabric that if it is a little bit of a breezy, summer breeze makes me feel fine. I'm sorry, I love that song. That just, it just works out perfectly. I thought it would be nice with some mushroom top slides. It still plays into the summer vibe gives me a chance to wear closed-toed shoes because now that we're drawing closer and closer to the chilly days, 
I'm, I'm trying to get rid of the sandals, you know? You can't wear sandals all freaking fall, I'm sorry. I mean, you could, but faux pas, I'm just kidding. <laughs> Do what you want, live your life. This pair of overalls totally reminds me of those deep, dark, gorgeous plum red colors that we see in the trees and the ivy leaves, perhaps some oaks and maple as well. Since this is such a baggy fit, I thought, what the heck am I going to wear with this that really plays into the elegance that I really like about this set? I was playing around with different shirts and I finally came across this incredible slip shirt. It's actually a, a lingerie top, this super blushy, pretty pink, laced all in the bodice and the chest. Funnily enough, it's vintage Christian Dior, and I managed to thrift this. Yes, I thrift the lingerie section. Just do it, because you will find some vintage Dior. I think this outfit is a match made in heaven. Truly. Thoroughly. Of course, with a baggy overall, I had to pair it with my mushroom top slides. What better shoe to wear with them? There's not much that you have to do with this, but pair it with a really cute velvet scrunchie that matches the burgundy. This is a fit. I love this. This is a fit, okay? I, did, I just thought it was genius putting the lace with the velvet overall. It, it just makes sense. Makes sense. Some things in life, they just go, you know? There are a ton of outfit ideas I have for the fall, especially because this is one of my favorite seasons to dress. Layers, colors, those are just two of the most beautiful things in fashion. This beautiful rust brown off the shoulder top. I wear it on my shoulders just because I have a little bit of a heavier chest. Being able to wear this on my shoulders, it makes the sleeves quarter sleeves. However, I think it's still works very well for the style. It has this incredible lining with the ribbon that creates this V shape on the front of the crop top. I personally really love billowy sleeves. It makes me feel whimsical, almost like a fairy goddess, if you will. Totally feel in my element in this outfit. This is probably my favorite. <laughs> I have this incredible pair of black trousers. They are just pleated enough and baggy enough that it really complements this almost sexier, a little bit flirtier top. It's a little busty. It's a little busty. Being able to wear these billowy tailored bottoms kind of just balances out the fact that it is a little bit more revealing. However, it's beautiful. I think it fits really well. I am wearing my moccasins with this outfit just because it pairs perfectly with this rust brown. This outfit kind of just screams the start of autumn to me. Some days in the autumn, I can get away with wearing a really short crop top or super tight mini skirt or something. I think that this one is top tier when it comes to the start of transitional weather. <laughs> it has the colors, the romantic kind of energy going along with it. This is an outfit I would wear to anything absolutely anything. I, I would wear this anywhere, truly. Like I'm an autumn queen. <laughs> well, anyways. Not only is it time to pull out all of these gorgeous colors for autumn, it's time to pull out the spicy and deep, rich teas to enjoy for the holidays. And I do mean holidays, all the days. Autumn, Hallow's Eve, Thanksgiving the holiday, it's all the days. September, October, November, December, those are four sisters, Though that quadruplet, they're like family to me. Yes. Perhaps this was a little entertaining. Maybe you found a little bit of fashion inspo. Perhaps you remembered something cool in your closet to drag on out for the season. Let me know what kind of things you're excited to wear for this upcoming season. We like to bring the outdoors indoors during this time of year. Uh, we like to bring the romance, the style, the chicness, the tea. <laughs> Cheers to a transitional season. This is a really fun time to explore my wardrobe. Where I am, we have all four seasons, strictly and determinately, almost. I like to play up the seasons as much as I can. Thank you for hanging out. Until next time.
Bye.